Hey, you know what's awesome? Holy shit, what is going on? What is this insect in my ear? Alright. Okay. I fixed the cable. I had to actually find that cable. I just want to talk about how this is the third time I'm recording this. It was a great intro, too. I, I was talking about my PS1, how it's still working after 15 years, and, it, and you know, after I, began, after I finished talking about that story, it just crapped out on me. And it did that twice. And then now I'm switched over to my PS2. And then I got blue screened. And here I am again. The, this, that is the expression I have on my face right now. The, that one right there. So we're gonna watch the intro. I've only watched it once, actually. This before I could even get started. Oh, I'm just exhausted. My gingarale. Oh, those polygons. Damn. I'm glad they switched their voice actors. Sounded much better. Alright. So, the reason I've done this game, it was a pretty simple one. Uh, well, two reasons. One, freaking game cravings. Everyone's had game cravings. And nostalgia factor. There's so much I could talk about this game. Alright. So. I was so exhausted because I had to dust off my PS2, and uh, the power cable was like. power cable was like, hold on, I think I have to, hold on, my controller's not working, this is good, this is cool. I think that worked! Hey, it worked! I just had to swap with a PS1 controller. I have no idea why that, out of all things, that's working. I have to fix my cable again. <laughs> out of all things, that worked. Well, it's a good thing I had my PS2 plugged in now. So, oh, yeah, well, we kind of... It's it's fine. It's fine. We're just, we're just doing the game. Uh, this is not a 100% run. This is simply just cruising through the game. Not really a speed run, either. But I'm planning to do all three games. With varying, varying degrees of success. <sighs> Why? Why doesn't the PS2 controller work with... PS1 games. I just I'm back to the the small gritty see-through controller. They don't make controllers like this anymore, which is sad. They almost made a boomerang control. That those were the days. Uh if I sound frustrated, it's probably because I completely am. I'm just a hundred and ten percent done with this game. <laughs> it's not because anything to do with the game. So I'm pretty adept into it. I mean, the reason I missed that boxer is I'm about to do something really pro. One thing I was really happy to show off the first time I played this, not, well, first time I tried recording this, and it didn't work out because the PS1 crept on me. Well, actually, since since this is working fine, I might actually I can go back and play Final Fantasy VII again. I actually try going through that because I was having a good time with that game, but I couldn't like make it to the next safe point without like get constantly crapping out. So I might just do that, but that that won't be in a video. That's just be on my own time. <sighs> so much done in my tone, the voice. So yeah, this this is like way back in 1999 when I first got my PS1. This is not the first game I got, but this was one of the first games I've gotten for sure. And wow, there's just so much nostalgia in this. The fact that I still know how to do this this little trick right here just shows that. I mean, I'll get over it by the next level. Better check this out. Check this pro ass shit out. Uh, Alright. I'm just getting the gem here because it's pretty easy and I can just show you how the gem looks in this game. I keep getting all the boxes. Perfect. Just like how I feel right now. Uh, that's also my face. I got a memory card. 
we're gonna save our game. I also put the uh, thing in there. We're looking for memory card. Insert memory card. Well, we're gonna have to try to do that again. I'm freaking wiping my brow and I'm sweating my rust breathing in the chemicals because this is just all right so I might be asking what is a jungle roar well we're gonna see what one of those are in just a bit but first before minecraft we have TNT blocks oh my god so much innovation and I just killed kicks from uh, Animal Crossing and that was I think his cousin too so there we go we're gonna absolute wreck every look at that can't even um well, okay. That was a cool little secret, I guess. Uh, we can't really get the gem here anyway because this little shit that's coming up ahead. Oh, okay. And we need like to make a platform out of this other gem that we get from that level. But to get that one is a really shitty level, a really shitty island. Can't wait to talk about all that shit. Alright, for those of you who haven't really played through or know much about the sea, oh, and that's okay, we got a little extra hit there. Uh, just spin things. Oh god, and then you run into them and like almost die. Okay, there was no TNT in that one. I think that's in the another level. If you get three of these, bonus level. And you know what the reward for the bonus level is? So I can just show this one's pretty easy, but the later ones get a bit harder. Uh, you get to save your game. If you die, um, no saving for you. All right. I did get 100% in this game a long time ago, but after doing that, I'm like, fuck that, I'm never doing that again. It wasn't like Mario Sunshine. It's like, oh, I finally got everything. It's like, the amount of bullshit they throw at you is just enough to make me say that. Alright. So I think what I might do is I might just do like a 25 minute half hour session and then just go from there. And look, there you go, this is the end of the level. I believe there's like three boxes up there that I missed. Yep. The fact that I remember the exact number is just this, this is just showing. Like, I know like, I know the ins and outs of the game that I've seen, like, back when I was younger, but this was, like, not the completionist sort of side. I mean, this was just... My main uh, objective back then was completing the game. That was it. This is not like... I mean, look at this shit. Oh, my God. I remember being stuck on here. Wow, because these jumps were just fucking hell. All right. Alright, and you don't automatically get the masks in this game, you just, you have to pick them up. We got a little bit of side scrolling. Also, there is something up there, I believe there's a 1-up or something up there. Life up there, but I'm not gonna go for it. Oh god! Fuck, that's our first death. Alright, that went pretty well. Also, if you die, you can't get the gem because it doesn't save your boxes, and you die just like, well, tough shit. So you have to get all the boxes and not to die. Which is, uh, really freaking hard in the later levels if I can't even do it in this one. Like, what, what, how do you expect me to do it for the other ones? Uh, but the thing, I would say I like the aesthetic of the game. Also, yeah, you can do that. It's, it's a bit amusing, but you, you lose a thing. Oh god. Everything can kill you in this game, I forgot. Alright, oh, look at that pro parkour. Amazing. I deserve that life. So, <laughs> about this level, we're getting to a certain point right now that I want to talk about. I'm still not sure where it is. I feel like I pretty much everything just like oh, oh these these things just just clinch every time you see them. It's like I do not want these going up my butt. Oh, oh, and they just did. That's okay. I have the mask. I have the mask protecting my butt. I put, I put the mask over my butt. These things. I did this, and I'm like, no, they're unstoppable. But you can just kill them like this. 
This is slippery. Yes, this is a bit slippery. This is a life. This is a test. Okay. Also, these monkey shits. Not not really a fan of the. Oh god. Oh. Good thing these guys don't like inherently hurt. You. Oh jeez. Oh. Ah. This is gonna be a lot like the first episode of Mario Sunshine versus where like. I'm still not used to playing on the small screen. These things. I always thought these looked kind of tasty. I don't know why. I'm like, oh, it's. Oh, we walked into a spike and we stabbed their face out. Good job. Oh, it's a good thing we got a checkpoint. And we're gonna. Do you know what's great about this? We can actually do editing this time. Alright, we're back here. It's, it feels so good to use editing again. And these things may look like common, like, oh, they're in every level. No, like, towards the end of the game, they're like, maybe like, two every five levels. So that's always a good time. Oh, look at that. Fucking fruit mayhem right there. Also, this was before they did the little shit where it's like, oh, you hit one of those blocks, now you fu- Oh, we fucked up. We fucked up. We're not getting the We're not getting the uh, save point. Tough shit! Mm. Oh god. Oh, but exit's right there. Oh, we can't get the gem anyway because we need the other thing for it. So it's fine. It's totally fine. I'm totally fine with this. Also, the fact that this is not blind is like I can talk about. Also, real quick, um, I guess I'll point it out after it. That thing near the level. It's. Um, I thought that was a macaron. Or a burger. Or like an ice cream sandwich. I've never had a macaron in my life, actually. I have no idea how they taste. They look like freaking colorful burgers. Also, this is some scary shit right here. I mean, I was I was scared of this when I was a kid because this is this is utterly terrifying. Also, the freaking music is like so intense. But like, I think is I think this game has like the best soundtrack out of any of the games in the series. Oh my god, this is so I think I can actually get the gem for this one. I'm actually gonna go for it. I'm not sure if this is or something else. I mean, like, if I... I'll attempt the gems, but I won't, like, go out of my way to get them. And if anything, if I get, like, a considerably high amount, maybe I'll go back at 100%. I don't know. It just depends. It just depends how this goes. Also, fun fact, I'm not playing with the analog stick, I'm playing with the D-pad, because this is how I played the game back in the day. I didn't use the analog stick- Oh, fuck, we died! See, look, it's like... It's so hard. And we got our life back, at least. This game is hard, basically. <laughs> One thing I want to talk about is, like, hard games of today and hard games of yesterday, because a lot of the games I see, they're trying to, like... Like, oh, we're, we're making the game hard to, like, emulate how games were hard back then. But the thing is, games were hard and they had some kind of, like, thing to them. Like, games now are just like, oh, we're gonna throw in 50 spikes and that's gonna be it. That's our difficulty. Oh, we were so close to that. Yeah, that was just, like, eye-opening right there. <laughs> so I put, like, the little emoji on the screen. I mean, just look at it. Does it look like a macaron? That's a macaron right there. Here we go. We're going up the stream. All right, up the peam. This one's a lot more relaxed than the other one. Although this water just looks like absolute shite. And hopefully we'll be able to save this time. I realize I haven't done an outro yet, but I'll do after this level. Another cool thing, I can do multiple, like, s like sessions in, like, one sitting. Uh, those leaf rafts. We're just jumping on furniture, it looks like. Also, this game is very concerning. Like, there's very, like, small jumps and very, like... You know. Oh, geez, what, what just hit me? Was that a fish? What the fish? Speaking of couple days, um, I might be making another series as well. Kind of a... Uh, one that I've been making, one, willing, want, blah, wanting to make for a while, but now I actually can make actually a little bit easier. 
Alright, let's just wait for this thing to open up that map. Oh, yeah, I need the gem for this one. That's gonna be like the majority of these early levels. Where I have to need something to come back to it. Oh, God. oh no! What the fuck? Hopefully it's still there. Okay, okay, good. <laughs> I overshot, I just went... In fact, I really have like three deaths so far, I think. Yeah, that's uh, pretty much kind of accurate to how this is going to look like. Just wait until we get to later levels. Oh, those are f hellacious. Ugh, those are going to be fun. If these ones are already giving me trouble. Then... Uh, at least this one's easy and I didn't fuck up. They also have some extra bonus lives in the, ma the, the side. So we're already 12% of the game, which... Kind of shows you how short it is. It's it's a very short game actually. Oh, that's right. I was I was about to do my outro, but then I was like, oh wait, we just haven't finished the level. Already absolutely high class performance right now. Beautiful. But there you go. There's the exit. So I'd like to thank you all guys for watching this first part. Uh, let me know what you think about it. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you like. Leave a like. Like. Put the thumbs up, I guess. Uh, follow me on Twitter, the new Twitter, that should be in the description, and I'll see you guys next episode where we take on the first boss of the game.